people. I will look older the next time you see me. <laughs> Now, in 
Good! 
guy can shoot. He may do that, or maybe he's a playmate.
I tried him and I gave him way too much. This time he's going to throw me in. Okay? Alright, stop. And now, hold on, he's going to bounce, which tells you he wants a fade screen. Come to that elbow. You've got to dive. He's going this way. And now, alright, you can slip or you can re screen. If you go, alright, stop right there. If you went to re-screen and he had the ball, go to him, then go re-screen him. If he didn't have the ball, you go re-screen him, you go re-screen him, and he comes back this way. Go, slip, slip, yeah. And you're just playing. I know you're looking at this saying, hey, ain't no way you're going to be able to do this. I don't think so either. But <laughs> it's good teaching it because they're learning how to play basketball. So now he comes down and we'll just yell. Face, face, face! He's getting me here. How about this move? You ready? I curl. He steps back, curl it. Whoop! Sway, and we're playing basketball. I come over to do this sort of swimming. And I'm going to do face swimming. My name goes like that. I know where to go. If you get it, he's coming back and getting it. But right now, you get him twice. If this is my big guy, we'll get him twice. I am a, a seven-footer Nick, and I'm saying, Nick, scream twice. Face scream, no, you got it. Face, face, face. Okay, you ready? Come on, 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 come on. So, we're doing stuff on this side just to get the ball swung over there, okay? Um, if we went a fourth guy uh, and we were doing four on four, um, we would say, coach and I, if you go to man, you'd be away, you'd be away. And if he yells punch, as he comes this way, you go there, you go there. And then I'm trying to get to where you can throw the ball, go, hit, that's four on four, and that's where we've been playing right now. We can't really post up, we struggle throwing it in the post, and guys are running, cutting middle right now. The problem with the middle cut, it jams everything up. I like the baseline cut. It's hard to go baseline if the guy caught it, how do you go baseline? Yeah, he's down in there somewhere, you can't. Or I throw the ball from here. How am I going to go baseline even if he's where he is? So you need to get down. And again, I'm going to get down and start like this. He's going behind me, we're just playing. Because we're spread out all over the floor. Alright, now, um, here's, here's the, the other thing. Does anybody in here, are you using the term one more now? Raise your hand if you're using that term, one more. Alright, so so let me, for all of you, um, I was just in Miami watching the Heat play. They didn't even work out, they ended up playing pickup. In the pickup game, every time down the court, someone was yelling one more. So that wasn't used two, three years ago. It's being used now. Before I get into that, I gotta say, you know, where do you think Kevin Durant catches the ball most times? Where do you think? Durant. Wing high, right, the big three-point line. No. He catches it right there where you said. So he runs down, he'll run a back screen, go, and he'll catch it right here. Okay? He will get it, fly on the court, throw the coach, throw the coach, stop. Alright? If they don't throw the coach, he's around, swing it, come and get me, drive it, and then they go to the ramp right here. He's 
intentions are right there. Go away. Get away like the elbow. Girl, good. Pop back. That's good. So I did it because I wanted my players. I put it on tape. There are 15 of them. I just wanted them to see. You want to be Durant? Get your ass in the post. Get down in there.
this every day for three or four minutes, they get into that half and they get the ball from one side to the other. I'm watching Miami Heat. They just got Olenek. Where was he? Where's Olenek play? Here or there. So their center's going to be out like this. So what's open for every one of these guys? So now it's like bam, bam, and every, every one of them. One more, one more. If you hear one more, you got to throw. If he's not, he ain't saying one more if he's guarding. You caught it. You get behind it. You throw it. You saw it. Hey, you take it throw in there. We're out. He's yelling one more. One more, one more. Sometimes one more is a skip pass. The guy's on the weak side. One more, one more. That means pass me the ball. Now, you caught it. He said one more. What would happen if this man went like this? Drive. Well, I want to throw behind. So now you're driving and you're throwing him that shot and you're doing the same. You're replacing to that line. So now he cannot pass it because there's a guy there. Alright, here we go. One more, one more, one more, one more, one I got Kevin Knox right now. Every time he catches it, and what is that every single time? It's a wall. All I'm saying to Kevin Knox, 6 9! A guard. Why would you fake? Catch the ball. And five, six, nine, fly the guy. This way or that way. You catch that thing and you know he's there. You know he's there. You're there right now. Bang, he shoots it, you go there. Okay? Here we go. One more, one more. Yeah. 
fan is at the nail. So you drive and move him out. Okay, stop. This fan's in. Take one of my yoga right now. One more, one more! So you may take him out. So that ball comes this way. Space. And now I'm driving the evil. You're going there. Okay? So we're doing that now. So now we're adding, looping out, but we're going one more because I'm standing here and the guy's not near me. And I'm catching it I'm trying to get a layup. Because so my man is like this. And I'm seeing him. And you move right where you know this is a hard cover. Get in there. Thank <laughs> you. 